welcome back to my channel um today i'm going to be doing an inspired look by selena so this is the makeup that i'm doing looking like selena super inspired by her because um it's her 23rd anniversary since so she's been gone um and she's no longer with us it's been 23 it's been 23 years since 1995 the day that they took her life away so i decided to make a look inspiring her makeup and inspiring her in her memory so yeah if you guys want to know how to get the selena vibe look then stay tuned and you will first things first i'm going to start putting this oil on my face because this just makes my face super smooth and it makes my makeup that much easier to apply it on it's just oh it's life and it is uh for for sally rose gold Elixir and it looks like that with the golden flakes. I think I've showed you guys this before um, It has cute little golden flakes in it Like that Super adorable. So I'm gonna apply a couple drops of that It also moisturizes my skin that way my pores Don't get too clogged with my makeup um, It's just Oh, it smells like oranges, I don't know, with roses. It's just amazing. The difference of what this does to my skin is just, you guys, fabuloso. Okay, I usually start with this and then let it sit on my face before I do anything else. So, yeah, let me just take my time doing my eyebrows like Selena's. Hers were a little bit round. So hers weren't too squared, if you could tell and look at her pictures, her eyebrows are pretty round so I'm going to do that and they look really drawn on, they didn't fade away like they do nowadays with the girls. And they were really really thin, if you guys look at her pictures, she had thin eyebrows. I honestly used to do my eyebrows round when I was younger. Um, I just liked how that round style looked. You know, like I used to call them the style of how I would you eh, the style of of how I would used to do my eyebrows. I would call it the spider leg eyebrows because I felt like they looked like spider egg, eggs, spider legs. Um, no joke though, I was like, shit, that looks like a spider's leg. Every time I look at somebody's eyebrows, like it was a style back then having like the round in the inner corners. Um, and now it's just like the gradient, uh, the gradient fade away eyebrows are in style now. Square, but before it was like, the spider leg eyebrows everybody had. Some people still have them like that. Um, it's just what one prefers. All right, so now that I have the eyebrows done, I'm gonna go ahead and start with the eyes. Okay, now going on to my Naked 2 palette, I'm gonna go ahead and grab the color. Um, Una Momento. So I'm going to go ahead and gra grab my Naked 2 palette and I'm going to be using the color Tease, which is this one right here. Color Tease, you can see me in the mirror, in the dirty mirror. So grab my Naked 2 that I haven't used this Naked 2 palette in forever. Like this palette is destroyed. Mama's like, you have no idea how freaking destroyed that is, but whatever. Before I actually even do anything to my eyes, uh, for this look, I'm just going to use concealer. I'm not going to use uh, an actual primer for the eyelids. I'm just going to go ahead and go in with my Age Rewind Concealer and just put that all over my lid. Okay, I'm going to go in with the color Tease um, as a transition and probably the only color I'm going to use. I'll see because 
didn't look like Selena would put that much makeup. It's just the lips and the smile that would stand out on her face. So, yeah. And then I'm going to grab the color, um, the color copper on here with that same brush. I'm going to just do it like on the ends. I'm just going to apply it on the ends. That same color all over. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and apply it all over my lid. Just to look like I have a little bit of eyeshadow. And this is... And this is actually quite simple. I don't want it. Like, I'm doing this on purpose. I'm applying my eyebrows. I'm applying my eyeshadow this way on purpose because I just want to put a color there. But I don't want to look like I'm wearing that much makeup on my eyes. Because that's how I felt like Selena, you know, was. It, her main look wasn't her. Her main look wasn't her eyes or what makeup she had on. Her signature look was a bold red lips and her smile, her big bright smile. Okay, using my um, using my Miss Rose eyeliner and eyeliner sealer, sealer. It's my eyeliner marker. It has like a sealing, you know, for those of us, for those girls like me that fail on your um, wings. This has the wings on there that you could just stamp on. It's hard to use it, I don't use that. But I'm gonna use the side of the marker, which is the pointed side. Which is the pointed side, and I'm gonna start doing the wings. Cause you ain't Selena without wings. Fly away, little wings. Fly away. Okay, now that I have my wings, I'm going to go ahead and start my mascara. And I'm using the um, Bay of Pure, the one that I got, volume volumized mascara that I got for my BoxyCharm. And I'm going to apply this sister on. Yeah. Okay, so <clears throat> I hate my voice. I hate my voice. So after I do the wings and after I do the top part of Selenita's eyes, I am going to go ahead and look how beautiful she is. I changed the picture, by the way. I decided to do the inspired look on this one. And as you could tell, her eyebrows are way darker. Beautiful woman. Okay, going on to the foundation. Yes, that fast. You know I like to keep my makeup simple, I like to keep my makeup fast. Unless I'm actually wanting, this is just how I do my makeup. I look at other, I don't mean to hate or bash or anybody because I love how, you know, other artists do their makeup and they apply a bunch of stuff and it takes forever. I don't have the patience to do a lot of my face, to be honest, you guys. I don't have the patience. I've tried it and I try to be all makeup artists. But I just got to face reality. I'm not. And I'm going to keep doing makeup my way. Because I don't have time for that, all that. Like, holy crap. And I can't even do it. Like, I feel like I'm baking. And it's horrible. Like, it looks like somebody dropped cocaine all over my face. Or, <laughs> or a bag of powder or something, you know. So, yeah. This is how I'm doing it. I'm keeping it simple. I'm not going all, all the way out. Si te gusta bueno, si no, bueno. All right, where did the heck did my, I am not, I'm never prepared. When am I prepared? So using my drugstore Dream Liquid Mousse and Sunny Beige, 
foundation. This ring in the doorbell, who got locked out? One second, you guys, somebody's ringing the doorbell. Like, seriously? Sorry, guys, I'm back. Guess who rang the doorbell? My daughter. And she's probably gonna ring it like a million times more. They're outside um, riding their bikes since for once Sita decided to actually be spring. <laughs> so, she's like, she could reach the, the doorbell because our doorbell is very high. So, she's two. Imagine how low our doorbell is. <laughs> She's on her tippy toes ringing it. Okay, so I'm using my boob because that's what I'm gonna call it my booby. You know what I like about YouTube, you guys, is that you learn from YouTube and throughout the years you grow with everything you've learned. Like everything that I know how to do is because I've watched YouTube videos. And I feel like all artists started that way, started from the bottom not knowing anything, not being like actual artists, and now they're like, artist. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah, there goes my daughter again, you guys. I can hear my daughter screaming from here. I wonder what her dad is doing to her. Okay, so I use my boob and then I'm gonna use my brush too because like I don't like I said I don't have time to pat all over my face like gosh it takes forever unless I really want to go all extra and all out then I'll take my time to do my makeup but honestly you guys I don't know if it happens to most people or just me but I feel like when I don't even try doing my makeup good and I'm doing it fast it comes out better than when I take hours actually trying to make a look just like it came out on Facebook but it, it, I mean it looks good but it's just there's something wrong with it you know like something about it is I just end up hating and it sucks okay so once I did that I'm gonna go ahead and you could tell Selena in this picture, you guys, look at it good. Look at that contour and that baking. I don't think they baked back then, but it sure does look like she baked. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start contouring. Burp. I'm gonna start contouring after I conceal. And of course I'm gonna be using the Locket Concealer in the, in the shade Warm. I'm gonna use this concealer for a little bit of that. Alright guys, I was going to bake, but I don't feel like baking because um, I'm not hungry. <laughs> Just kidding. Just freaking kidding. Okay, so, uh, yeah, I was going to bake, but you guys will seriously laugh at me if you see the way I bake because I don't know what I'm doing. I just like pour that stuff in my face and I'm like, this is awkward and then I just brush it off. Okay, so next I'm going to start contouring. Contouring, contouring. I'm using this uh, crown brush that I got from my BoxyCharm as well. <laughs> Grab the wrong, wrong contour palette. <laughs> okay, that's really getting annoying. You guys are gonna be so annoyed by that doorbell, sorry. Okay, and then in that picture I see that she has, she has like rosy cheeks, um, cheekbones, so. Okay, next I'm using my Ulta Beauty palette with four and I'm gonna use this color right there. Um, it's Honey Bunny. Okay, so her, her rosiness looked like it was from up here down here, so.
just go ahead and do that. I'm next using my same highlight and contour um, palette. I'm gonna use what I used to, for my eyebrows. I'm gonna use the contour number two and I'm gonna be contouring my nose. Selena's nose is kind of like JLo's. It's kind of like a, it's a cute little nose. And then with my nose, with my nose, are you kidding me? With my finger, I just blend that like that. Girl, like J Lo's. If you guys have seen J Lo's nose, it's kind of like that as well. Selena did have um, black eyeliner in the bottom, so I'm gonna go ahead and put some. Um, if, if I knew where my black eyeliner was, okay, I can't find my other black eyeliner, so I'm just using this little eyeliner, and I'm gonna line my eyes, my waterline. I'm gonna line my waterline. What this is gonna do is gonna make my eyes shrink a little bit smaller. If you, if you girls know of um, an eyeliner that does not smear or smudge, Please let me know because I've tried so many even like waterproof ones and it still smudges and I'm like oh I can never find one I just have that look. Last but not least for this look I'm going to go ahead and um well not technically last because I forgot to put mascara on the bottom of my lashes but I'm going to start with the lips and she had really big juicy red lips you guys. That sounds so lesbian right now. Not that it's a bad thing but like juicy red lips. I'm gonna go ahead and outline my lips and right now I look like a chola. Okay. And then I'm gonna be using the crayon by Revlon. The red crayon by Revlon and it's the color Red Burst. My lips. That red liner is so bad so my lips probably look a little scary. But yeah, the last look for Selena um, this is the makeup I'm going to use for her. I'm going to hurry and put more mascara. And then I'm going to do her um, hairstyle to make it the finishing touch to look even more like her. Alright you guys, so... There we have it. I'm gonna swap shirts really fast because I wanna look more like her. Um, this screen is not going with the look. Although I like how it looks. It, I mean, it looks like I have, I'm repping like Mexico with the red lips, the green, the red lips and the green shirt. Hey girl, I'm going to the Mundial. Just kidding. But yeah, lots of people think I'm Mexican. Okay, I'm gonna go swap the shirt. Be right back. All right, you guys. I put a white shirt because I feel like it's more Selena. I don't have an outfit because this is just the inspired makeup by her. Um, I wish I did. I think it, this look would be more like her if I had the actual outfits that she wore or something similar, but I unfortunately don't have anything, not even the sideways hat. Uh, but she wore lots of big earrings like these ones right here. And then she also wore the hoop earrings, which I wish I had too, but I don't have anything. Um, so I'll just do my best to try to make it look as much as her as possible. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take all my baby hairs out. Guys, I'm back. This is like the closest thing I came to a Selena outfit is the leather jacket and the sparkly bra. I don't have anything else that like looks like Selena. So I wanted to look a little bit more like her. So yeah, guys. Um... I'm always gonna keep Selena alive because I freaking love her. I love her music, I love her songs. 
everything about her. So I hope you guys really like this look inspired by Selena. If you guys did like this look, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, then give it a thumbs down, whatever. But yeah, so if you like Selena, then come and sing this song with me. Bitty bitty bum bum. Bitty bitty bum bum. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm crazy. I'll stop. I'll stop. Now I'm gonna go and rock on to some Selena. And yeah. Que viva Selena y si sí, siempre nos vamos a acordar de ella y sus canciones. She's amazing. We miss her and I was one years old. I'm now living through her music and I'm happy that her music is still alive with us that we could share and I'm gonna pass on to my kids because they're gonna rock on to Selena too. I freaking love her. So yeah guys, until next time, thank you for watching. Maggie's ruining my video with a doorbell. It's not <laughs> funny. La voy a buscar. La voy a buscar, viste, la cadera empieza. No, no, Tati, go, Tati, go. No quiere que me la acerque. Porque sabe que la voy a agarrar. Okay, because she's ruining my video. Okay, hold on, yo necesito ir al baño, así que nos dejé a ellos tres sentados en la puerta, okay? Para que salgas a. You're gonna be number two. Yeah, para que salgas. A chequearse y revisarme en el camino. Okay. Tell her to stop ringing. <laughs>